everyone, thank you so much for watching. So today's video is gonna be a bit different from what I've been doing so far. So I'm gonna be making some binder covers for my red velvet binder and for my weekly binder. So let me know if you like these kinds of videos. Um, if you don't want this one, you may skip it. Um, let me know in the comments what you want me to do for my next video. But I just decided that it's about time that I should put a cover in one of my binders or two of my binders. As um, I had some extra Queendom albums um, lying around and then I really like the photo shoot for the girls version for Queendom. So I thought, why not make their binder covers so i don't know if you've seen my previous video of my like k-pop photo card collection so i already made one for my main red velvet binder um the photo card spider this is the cover of the one i made previously and it's just very simple and i just put them in like a card uh stock here at the back and then just put my extra finale albums here in a collage style so I actually made one for my weekly binder, however, unfortunately, I lost the footage for that one which sucks because I spent some time on it. So this is the cover that I made for weekly. So yeah, I just used my extra uh, WePlay albums and made a cover like this. So it's just mostly Zoa and Monday and then I put the group here and on the side here. Sorry, it's not quite focusing. And I just put the stickers from like the E-World version of Holiday. But yeah, so that's the cover that I made for Weekly. So I'm gonna warn you right now, most of this is gonna be real time. But I'm probably gonna fast forward some bits and pieces here and there. So yeah, let's just start. So what I like to start with is with these, I already separated them. So these are just like, oops, I can't grab it. Found stuff that I think what I want to include here. So it's just random like stuff that can be used for backgrounds, whatnot. So I don't know, just to make it look, I don't know, different, <laughs> I guess. I don't know what word to use. Like this, but I think that's too pink. And I kind of like this Sogi photo here and also Yeri, so maybe I won't put that. So maybe I'll just go like this now. Let me adjust the camera. Pardon for this tape. I don't have glue at the moment, but it's okay. It's going to be covered anyway. So I'm looking for more of those background things that I missed. Maybe I'll just use one of Sogi's because I do want this thing. Maybe something like this to start. And then I'll just add. Oh, that's kind of weird. Maybe I'll go like this. Yeah. So that's the base. And then. I have a bunch of Sogi photos here. I kind of want it more like Sogi centered. And then, cause I think this is, no, actually it's not for my Sogi binder. It's still my red velvet main binder, but we'll see. I can use Sogi's right here. Maybe I'll put right here. I don't know for sure, I'll use it. Thank you. 
so I think that's my initial layout and then I'll just add more stuff as I go I just realized we should have cropped them. I do want to cut this one. This is what it looks like so far. So I feel like I just need a couple more things and then I'm done. Milkshake. It looks like it's for Yeri. I'll be using these Queendom stickers from the album. Maybe I'll take out Suki here and put Wendy instead. Ah. Okay. Woo. Ah.
Okay, so this is the finished cover. So I just um, fixed some stuff here and there, put some more tape in the side, and added some random, like, just to like fill up the gaps here. Um, it's not perfect, but it's okay. It's just on the sides. But yeah, and then I added the stickers around. So I think it's all right for me. I don't know. Some people might think it's just too much like clutter. It's a mess. But I feel like that's the aesthetic I was aiming for anyway. But yeah, I think overall I'm satisfied with how it looks. So I measured it beforehand. It should fit, I hope. Oh gosh, if it didn't fit. <laughs> it's just getting stuck with some of the... Because I didn't glue them, so it's getting stuck on the photos. It's okay. Yay! Alright, I had to adjust the camera so you can see it better. But yeah, it fits exactly in front of the binder cover. My measurements were correct. I think I like it. It's a bit, yeah, it's a bit too much compared to my other one, I feel. But it's okay. So this is my finale one and this is my queendom one. But yeah. I don't know if I should uh, fill out the sides as well here, but for now I'm done with this one. And this is my binder for the in album inclusions, only 5 album inclusions. So yeah. So so happy that I finally made a cover for this one. And while we're here, I might as well do a quick flip through of my weekly binders. So this is the first time I'm doing this one after all of the updates that I've been doing in the past couple of months since I joined two fan signs and I was able to collect uh, for OD7 for like album inclusions and photo cards. So yeah, this looked different from my last K-pop photo card collection video. And also, this might be the best time to announce in this platform that I think I'm going to be collecting a weekly OD7, at least from their debut We Are um, album up to holiday for now. Since I do have a lot of extra We Play and holiday cards, I thought like maybe I could try to trade for like the older cards. We'll see if that's gonna work out. Wish me luck, but also I'm here to plug my Instagram. So if you guys want to trade with me or buy, I have a bunch of extra weekly cards. I would love to trade with you, uh, to be honest, rather than sell them because I'm trying to find those older cards. But like I said, I'm not gonna be in a rush. I'll do it as I go along with my collecting since I'm also collecting a bunch of other groups with like recent comebacks like NCT and Red Velvet. I feel like it's not going to be a wise decision for me to just like go ham with like the card collecting for weekly at the moment. But yeah, I'm still definitely interested in trying to complete my OD7 set, at least from We Are and We Can uh, eras. And then we'll see after holiday if they have a comeback uh, in the next couple of months. We'll see how I will collect for that one because I don't want to burden myself with too many cards or yeah, like I feel like if I can't handle it anymore, then I'll probably tone it down again to my top 2 or maybe top 3. But yeah, no, this is a day late, but happy 500 days to weekly since debut. So I'm super super proud of these girls and I'm very excited to see what they have in store next. Hopefully Jiyoon will be back with them, but as usual, I want her to come back when she's ready and when she's feeling better. But we're all patiently waiting for her and I'm just looking forward to what they have next in store for us. So yeah, so let's just jump in right ahead. So when I open my binder, there's nothing here on the side. I just put um, red velvets there because this was my old red velvet binder. But I just put this extra stickers that I had from like e -word album sticker that I didn't like put here on the side. And then there's just this divider here. And then this is a collage that I made from my very first a weekly video call yeah like just screenshots and I just put it like spread like this so yep and then on the next page here there's just some like uh, fan sign details that I have like the email that I got from MMT that um, I won the fan sign and all that so 
I'll just skip that part and I won't show you that because it has my full name on it, right? So this is my first page, so right off the bat, it looks different from how I laid it out before. Uh, before, what I did is that I put all of Monday's album cards with her non-album stuff, and then next will be Zoa's album and non-album, or whatever I have on hand, since I don't collect her non-album, and then the very end is anything OT7. But now I decided to just put all of Monday's non-album cards at the front, and since I'm collecting OT7, I just merge all of the album cards together. So how I lay this out is similar to how I do Red Velvet. So Sugi is with the rest of the girls for an OT5 binder, and then her non-albums are in a separate binder. But for now, since I don't have that many non-album for Monday, they're just all in the same binder as my OT5 photo cards. So yeah. So let's begin. So this page is all we are photo cards. So this first one at the top here is MMT. I really like this card. Um, I really like their like uniform like outfit photo cards. So I'm glad that we got a non-album for this one. And then the next one is a Make Star photo card. And then this one I think is Apple Music. So for we are, thank goodness, I think they only had three, yes. So these top three rows are the only pops they have for we are. And then from there on, they started putting out more and more pre-order benefits as like they had more comebacks, which sucks for a wallet. But happy I guess as a collector since we get more like selfies from the girls and they're all so pretty. Uh, now we're going to We Can, I think. Right, so this is We Can. This is a Make Star card. And then I think this is also another Make Star uh, photo card as well, from what I can remember. And this, I'm not sure, but it might be from a Korean music site. So cute. And um, this shirt reminds me of like Red Velvet, honestly. It's like the stripes, it's like Dum Dum Era. And then this is My Music Taste 1, from what I can remember. Or actually, these might be my music taste because the backs look the same but yeah so this might be my music taste one and this is my music taste two and this is from another music site uh, from korea and then this is the with drama global photo card and this is with drama china i don't have with drama thailand because those ones um, are a bit rare so i'll hopefully one day i'll be able to find it and this is an online broadcast card and this is the 2020 season's greetings card um, I only got Mondays for that one because I wasn't um, able to buy a full set at that time and then we move on to WePlay so the rest here are the WePlay cards so this one is Make Star, the first one I think and this is the second one and the third one this card right here is one of my faves and it's in the middle so perfect it's Glasses Monday, she's so pretty and the backs are very colorful, I like it. But yeah, Glasses Monday. And then the next one is My Music Taste, the first round, I think, from what I can remember. Yeah, because I'm missing the round two for My Music Taste, which is the red one. So this is My Music Taste one, and this is the third one. And then, this is another with Drama Hollow. Another pretty card, again, one of my faves. Then we're going to another Korean music site photo card. And this one I think is Apple Music Korea. This green one right here is from another music site that I forgot. These two uh, I remember are from Tower Records because the cards are sharp at the edge here, so that's how I can tell them apart. And they're from Tower Records, it says here at the back. And this is the weekly anniversary card. Um, I cannot remember how much you should spend on like the merch, but after you're spending a certain amount of money, you get a photo card set. So I only got Mondays for this one. And then now we move on to holiday. So this last three here are like holiday cards. So this first one here is a Make Star Hollow. So pretty. Again, hollows are my weakness. And then these two here are from Mixter as well, but I think it came with Zoa one because from the group order I joined. I think for this round, you get two pre-order benefits per album, so I ended up getting Monday and Zoa. Since I don't collect Zoa's pre-order benefit cards, I just kept her here. But yeah. And then these two again are the Tower Records for this era, and this is Apple Music one. 
again another fave of mine because of like the paw so cute but yeah it doesn't say what's uh store it's from at the back but i think this is from apple music from what i can remember and then another uh, i can't remember probably music korea and then this one is my music taste one and this is my music taste two and then another hollow here this y global so cute and then beat road and then this is john music i think and now we move on to the seasons greetings inclusions i got two because i accidentally double ordered it but it's okay so i can display both sides and yeah so that is it for my monday uh, non-album cards that i have so far we'll now move on to od7 stuff so on this first page here it's pretty empty but this is where i will put we are like the a version cards so so far i only have sujin monday and zoa and the next one is the b version so i have four members this time including jiu and then the polaroids this time i have jay here so it's still pretty empty and then i have the stickers from the album here and then now we'll move on to uh, weekend so i only have mostly monday and zoa from my previous collection and then i just added two here which is Jin and Sujin. so some are still on the way and some i'm still looking for so again i'm plugging my instagram here if you want to trade with me please dm me there i would love to trade with you and i'm thanking you in advance for helping me with my collection so now we'll move on to full sets that i have this is we play so first uh, this is the jump version i really love this jihan card here and this is jump tarot again jihan's cards for we play are so cute to be honest this is so adorable like she's so cute anyway honestly if i can collect jihan as well i would but i gotta limit myself <laughs> Uh, now this is the up version photo cards and this is the up tarot version photo cards so now this is the only full set i have for pops because this is the pre-order benefit set that i want from the fan sign so this is my music taste round three pre-order benefit cards and now we'll move on to the four cut cards that i have here so i put jump at the top and up version at the bottom so sujin units on the side here and this is monday and so on jehi jihan and so on and now we'll move on to play game holiday cards so this is e word blue version e word navy version uh just like the color of the pack this one's blue and this one's navy and this is emerald pink and this is emerald purple again this is one of my favorite sujin cards now it's milkshake sujin she's so pretty and this is the era where she's bias wrecking me so hard <laughs> like on top of zoa sujin is also a bias wrecker <laughs> but she's so cute and they're all so pretty i love the cards and now this is the full again my other full fan sign pre-order benefit cards for the fan sign so this is my music taste round two and if you've noticed i also have a monday here even though i already have monday at the front so if you flip back i also got a monday here because i just wanted a full ot7 spread and i have an extra so why not <laughs> So I have extras of those and now we'll move on to the postcard. This is the group and then the member version specific for the eWorld um, album and the bookmarks at the back. Uh, Ji Yoon and Monday, uh, So and then J, and then Ji Han and Soa. Uh. Yeah, so now this is Emerald. So again, same layout, group card, and then Sujin, her bookmark, Jihan and Monday, So and J, and then Jihan and Sola. 
then I have the stickers here on the side. And now I have some miscellaneous extra cards that I have. So I have two weekend message cards here. Three of this group card version here and then the other versions right up there. And now we'll move on to the last part of this binder. So these are just the anniversary goods. These are so pretty. So I just laid it out again as OD7 here and have the unit cards at the top. And the other unit card is right up here with the full group card down here. And then these are the Polaroids. And then the IDs. Um, I have no idea how to store them properly so just put them at the back here because they're just so small. <laughs> And then this is the accordion booklet postcards, so I just took them all out of the accordion booklet and put them in here. Um, at the back is their transparent bookmark, so that's Sujin and Jiu, Manny, So, Jay, Jihan, and then Zoa here, the film strip, and the other one is at the side here. So yeah, that is a quick flip through of my weekly binder, so I'm super excited to see how this binder will grow uh, in the next couple of months. And yeah, keep supporting weekly, they're such lovely girls, and I hope you do check them out. I really love their music and their discography. But yeah, that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching again everyone, I really appreciate it. So yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Peace! Peace!